This is a News 4 update. Good morning, I'm Marissa Hollowed, and here are some of the stories making headlines. Right now, four suspects are on the loose after breaking into an ATM in Ellisville. It happened at the Bank of America on Clayton Road at about four this morning. The suspects stole cash boxes after they used a white pickup truck with a chain hooked to the back to pull the machine open. Anyone with information is called, uh, asked, excuse me, to call Ellisville police. Right now, we are pressing for answers after a St. Louis officer was hurt while trying to track down multiple suspects. We're told an officer was hit by a BMW last night after two suspects sped off from a traffic stop in North City. That officer was taken to the hospital with a leg injury. Police are still searching for suspects that were inside the car. A million dollar highway project gets underway at midnight in Illinois. Tomorrow, IDOT starts a huge 10 month rehab project on I-255. On Saturday, the north section will close. It'll remain closed until May or June. The whole project is expected to be complete by Thanksgiving. All right, the weather's going to be overcast again today. Not looking for much in the way of sunshine. Uh, it is a little bit warmer, which is nice. 42 degrees, but again, mostly cloudy skies. Could even see a little light drizzle here or there. I think that's more likely tonight. As you go through the day today, you see we stay under the overcast. And then as we get into the evening, maybe a sprinkle again overnight, kind of like we saw this morning. Temperature should remain above freezing for most of us. I don't think that's going to be a problem. However, the clouds greet you Saturday morning and hang with you most of the day before the back edge of the cloudiness makes its way through just in time almost for sunset in the evening. So not a lot of sunshine on Saturday, but once those clouds clear overnight Saturday night into Sunday, oh man, does it look good. 42 today, 47 on Saturday, warmer, clearing overnight Saturday night, super sunny and 67 degrees on Sunday. Just looks like a gorgeous day. Uh, those temperatures may vary a little bit as we get a little closer. We'll see. But Monday, uh, close to 60 degrees, and then a chance of rain on Tuesday. That could change over to a little bit of a mix on Wednesday. That's your News 4 update.